please rise. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Geneva. I hope you had a great long weekend. I'm Blake Sankowski, and today we've got a lot store like club updates and an interview all about the speech team. All that and so much more because GTV News starts right now. morning announcements for Tuesday, October 12th. This Friday, the Spanish, French, and German clubs are going to join together for the first ever Halloween Challenge scavenger hunt. This contest will begin at 4.15 p.m. on the courthouse steps. Each language will receive a prize for the winning team and a bonus prize for the champions. Sign up with your club with Frouse Weidenbank in J240, La Don Bello in J241, or Senor Parin in J242. The speech team is looking really good this year. GTV reporter Stephen Meyer sat down to ask all about what is new and about the team throughout and how you can get involved. Thank you. We're joined by Allie Morris from the GHS speech team. So Allie, um, you're on the speech team. Could you tell someone who doesn't necessarily know what that is, like what speech team is about? Sure. Um, so it's basically a team where you uh, engage in competitive speaking, acting, uh, you basically uh, participate in a category and compete with other students from other schools uh, in your speaking or acting category. Is there necessarily a category for someone who isn't comfortable like standing up and maybe just giving a straight speech or like acting out a play or something? Well, there's like there's a lot of different um, kinds of categories you can do that aren't like the classic on a podium giving a mm -hmm. speech. Uh, so there's some acting categories like uh, humorous interpretation where you give sort of like skits. Uh, there's like humorous interpretation and dramatic interpretation. And then you can also do it in partners. So there's humorous duet acting and dramatic duet acting. Uh, if you like acting, um, there's some reading events. Uh, if you don't want to write or really do a speech, you can do poetry reading or prose reading. Uh, and then there's some, there's some traditional speaking events like uh, the uh, original oratory. Mm -hmm. uh, that would be where you would like give like fight for a cause. Like yeah. You would give it with a purpose, uh, the speech. Mm -hmm. um, original or not original, uh, oratorical declaration. Uh, that's where you take someone else's speech if you don't want to write your own and um, uh, just perform it. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot of different opportunities. Yeah, it sounds like there's a really great opportunity for everyone who, for, and everyone can find something they, they want to get involved in. Mm -hmm. um, of those, which ones do you participate in? Um, so for my, the last two years, I did humorous duet acting. Uh, this year, I'm going to try uh, poetry reading. So a little different. Um, but yeah, it's a, there's a lot, of, a lot of different opportunities to uh, try a lot of different things involving speaking or acting. Yeah. Oh, that sounds really great. Um, is there anything you'd like to say um, with regards to people who want to come to meetings? Where can they find you guys? So uh, we're in the mobiles now uh, every Monday. So day's changed a little bit, but now we're Monday right after school uh, in mobile four. Uh, yeah, so every Monday right after school, yeah. All right. Thank you so much, Allie. Yeah, no problem. Now back to you guys at the desk. Thanks, Stephen. The Boys and Girls Bowling Team will be having an informational meeting this Thursday in EE191. Email Coach Zimbroff or Coach Meister if you can't attend the meeting. Varsity Cheer will be holding tryouts on Thursday, October 21st from 5 to 7.30 p.m. in the Mac Olson. Anyone interested must register by October 20th. Contact Ms. Murphy with any questions. In weather, the fog this morning is setting spooky scene for October. There will be a High of 68 and a low of 59, and a jacket might be the way to go today. And now here's 3 to know before we go. Your technical honor society application is due tomorrow, and their first meeting will be held the following day. The GTV club is meeting today after school.
and a quick reminder that there is no school tomorrow as juniors take their PSATs. Well, Geneva, I'm Blake Stefowski. My time up is here on GTV. On Thursday, you'll be meeting Caitlin Fowles. That's all the news we have for you today. Have a marvelous Monday, Geneva.